Hello and welcome to this tech tip video. Today I'm going to show you how to manage uh, triple tier terminals within ePlan P8. So let's begin by going to the data portal and downloading a terminal. I'm going to use this Alan Bradley terminal here. I'm going to insert it into my parts database. So now we've got the part in our database. Let's go to insert device and let's locate the part in our database and let's take a quick look at the function template this terminal has been broken down into each of its levels and as you can see each level has been assigned a number one will be the lowermost level and three will be the uppermost level so let's hit OK to insert the terminal once we've inserted the terminal we can look at the terminal strip in the navigator if we locate it and right click and go to edit we can see that this multi-level terminal has been assigned one part number so let's hold it hit OK we can also generate an entire terminal strip by right clicking and going to new terminals devices we can give it a new DT and then assign it a part number I'm going to assign a numbering pattern. And now I'm going to tell the next terminal in this pattern. And then I'll give it the end number in this pattern. As you can see, it's given me 30 new functions since this is a three tier terminal. And I'm going from one to 10. So I'm going to hit OK. And as you can see, ePlan generates this entire terminal strip. And I can place this how I did previously. Again, if I right click and edit on this terminal strip, I can see that I've generated the entire multi-tier terminal strip here. Okay, I hope that was helpful. Thank you.